Lewis has arrived. The bathroom's a real mess now. He's put chasing in all the walls. Yeah. Everything's coming down. Yeah. And he's working over here. So uh, we've got some work going on with the electrics. It's the first um, fix. And um, Noel will come t on Monday. And he will start on the bathroom. That's great fun. But I enjoy it when Lewis is here because he just gets on with the work and there's no complaints and he knows exactly what I'm telling him to do. So yes, everything's pipes and conduit going through right down into the kitchen, back kitchen area. So it's just a whole lot of wires, but we'll get through it all slowly. The library has been emptied again this morning because Lewis is going to do the electrics. So if we look, here's the library, it's all empty. And he's going to be putting electricity above these walls because I want to put bookshelves along here on this side and then a plug down the bottom and then if I have a desk here, we'll have three plugs here behind me so that I can use for the computer printers and anything else. So that is gonna happen. And hopefully Will will be here today and then we'll talk about the ceiling to be repaired. So Lewis is going to do the electrics today. It's gonna to be a big, big dusty mess. And then I can also clean up and then wash this floor before I put everything back again. So I'm glad I didn't wash it before. So yeah. And Lewis is busy here with the electrical box, adding more wires. <laughs> There's just one maze of wires over here. But we'll get through it. The birds are singing. I cut the grass on Saturday and everything looks neat and tidy now at the back and at the front. First fix for the bathroom has been put in for the electrics. So we've got that all done. And tomorrow Noel will be here to sort out the bathroom. Just an update. Lewis has um, filled in the holes over here where the conduit has gone into the walls and we're just waiting now for Noel to arrive and then we'll see what he's got to say. Let's go downstairs and see what Lewis is up to. We're filling in those holes over there. This, this room really smells musty. I have to open these windows up to air it out. Well, it's all the dust and I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if it's coming from the cellar coming up. So we're trying to figure it out. Somebody's here. Right, so the boys are out, going to explain to each other what's here. What? To the left, left, left. Are you wanting to go to the loo? Are we doing this one? No, this one. Are we going to stay here? <laughs> I'm looking, I'm thinking, that is the one that we Yes, this one. Yeah. Right. Right, so I'm running my wires down there, because that wall's getting insulated and boarded. Uh, so I the ceiling getting boarded, so it's real. Um, so yeah, those, they're, they're the lights. This light, I'm not sure, it might have to get moved, depending on where the shower goes. Shower's going. Yeah, well, uh, let's talk it about was. that. It was. The shower going. was going here. Yeah. yeah. It was. But I did take the ink out. Right. So, yeah, it depends where the shower goes, but one of them might have to probably be off-centre. 
Because they were waiting for the shower and they were late for it. Yeah. They were not exactly. over the. Uh, I think that you're taking that out, are you? Yeah. Yes. That, that, that. So I've got these two wines here because the syndrome's going there. That one's been ordered as well. That's what's been told. What are them two for? This is the plug next to the sink, and ah. then this is going to be the light switch because you have two, two lights inside the mirror like that. Right. Okay. So I need to just run a wire from the switch to, to the lights. I'll yeah. wait for you to get the boiler out of the way so there's not a million wires there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Right. That's it. So you've changed the plans again. I was thinking, because of that other room, okay, just yeah. to make it a little bit more pri I don't know. I don't know. Okay, <laughs> I'm now, I've opened my mouth and I'm more confused. I wondered if the shower would fit in here. Right. Okay, we have the basin over there in the middle. Yes. And have the toilet here. No, I don't think it'll look nice. You know what? Tell me, please. Right. Check my mount. Um. Well, we're going to just stand and talk about it and think about it, and then I'll come back and oh. tell you. Right. After two hours of deliberating. We've now come up with a plan in the bathroom and I'll show you what we're going to be doing. So let me go in here. I'm going to turn you around. Right. We've decided now that this wall is going to be broken down half of this doorway is going to come out. This doorway here will come out. We're then going to put a shower in here, which I've already got. It's going to be here, where the bath is. And the basin is going to be here. There's enough space to comfortably walk in. And with then here will be the toilet. And we've got enough space to put the wardrobes, the towels, and comfortably put a nice chair or a bench or whatever we tend to put here. So. That's what we've decided, and we've been down in the cellars discussing how the water's going to be diverted and how it's all going to be connected down into the cellar because this is connected to that hot water tank over there, hot water tank. So everything's going to be connected to the hot water boil, um, tank and boiler downstairs. So I'm quite excited. We've got a plan now, and it's going to work beautifully. So yeah, I think it'll be great. Well, this is the bath has come out now. And they're draining that hot water tank. So everything is being stripped. And the plan will now be, the toilet will be here and the shower is going to be here so we're going to put the shower here and the toilet there and the basin in the middle and there's going to be a lot of space around here so it's not a bathroom that's going to be i'm not putting in a bath so it's just going to be a shower a luxury shower room that's what we're going to be doing so we're busy draining this hot water tank Things are going in the right direction. So I'm quite chuffed with it. I'm just going downstairs now. This is what my entrance hall looks like, back to a mess. And Lewis is busy sorting out everything over here. God, how he knows what goes where. <laughs> Guess what? And it's, he's going to tidy up everything now. And the library's finished. We've just got to get the plugs in. Has to be done. And then the ceiling needs to be done. So, yeah. That's another project. But in the meantime, we'll get everything sorted. And it'll look nice when it's done. I 
I'm now, today I've vacuumed this, this floor and I'm busy cleaning it with a chemical to get it clean. And Noel is going to go underneath the cellar and lift up these floors. That has to be done as well because it's sinking over there. Some of the um, wood underneath has got woodworms, so he's got to reinforce them. And then I'm cleaning up here now. And hopefully it'll smell fresher because it smelled so moldy in here. And I think it was just too much mold. But anyway, I'm going to get it spotlessly clean like I did with all the others. Well, guys, I hope you've enjoyed the vlog that I've put together with all the boys being here and working. It's been great fun having them back and we're progressing well at the moment. And I'm really um, enjoying them seeing the progress that's being made at the present moment. It, and, it, you know, just the friendships and everything. Noel, the plumber that started working here, he's, he's a laugh, a real laugh. Absolutely. And he really knows what he's doing. And I'm happy about that. And um, Lewis is absolutely amazing the way that he carries on with his work. But next week, Will is also going to pop in and he's going to finish off part of the garage wall. And then we're going to talk about doing the ceiling in the library. So these are things that are going to happen next week and we're going to see progress. I'm still in the process of washing that floor. We've got to like wait for it to dry and then rinse it off and then put another product on and then rinse it off again and... Um, it's about six um, processes on that floor until I've got it clean and smelling back beautiful because inside there was really musty and moldy. And I'm, I think I've got it now. It's going to be nice and fresh and clean. So I've got another two more processes to do and then I should be finished. And when it's done, I'll show you the, the finished product of what it looks like. So if you've liked this video, give us a thumbs up and um, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet and share because it's scary <laughs> and i'll catch you on the next vlog see you soon bye